So this could be the world's cheapest uh, tube stereo system here. Um, I've got this. This is a 6J1 tube preamp kit, I guess, that uh, you can get on eBay for, I think the lowest I've seen it is $6 now. Um, and it goes together really easy. I actually got it for my son. Um, and I was just sitting around, just sitting around. He didn't want to mess with it. It takes 12 volt AC in. And so we just whipped it together in like less than an hour just to see. And then I just checked it out to see if it works. It does indeed work. So going into the preamp from this Fio X1 from a three and a half inch jack to RCA's in, RCA's out to this um, tube amp. That's a headphone amp that I've actually got wired up to run it to these desktop speakers here. That takes 24 volt AC in from the uh, power supply over here. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to hear what it sounds like and uh, kind of prove out that it works. So I am gonna try to find some royalty-free music here. Turn it on. Doesn't sound great, no, but it was something fun to play with. Um, I'm gonna try it actually with a different amp too. I've got one of those little Kinter cheapo amps. Why I'm wasting my time messing around with small audio devices, I won't know. But uh, hold on one second, I'll come back with a different amp. Okay, I'm back. Um, I wouldn't recommend running that other headphone amp as a desktop amp. It gets pretty hot. Um, I had it on for a couple hours. It didn't burn out or anything, but it was extremely hot. It's, of course, used to pushing headphones, which are, what, 30, 30 ohm and above. So, you know, these speakers definitely, that thing heated up. So then I've got this little, this is a cheapo Kinter amp. Um, it says 500 watts. Of course, that's not going to be right, but it's just one of these. I think I got this for six bucks. Make sure I don't short anything out over here. Um, this was an eBay thing, too, for a different project. So I just wanted to hear what this sounds like. I'll turn this on. Got music going again. Yeah, here we go. Oh, this is much louder too than the headphone amp, of course. Yeah. So, not a bad little preamp project. Six bucks and some time. Mm. Worst ways to spend your time.